What's up everybody, it's Brie here. Welcome to Vinyasa Wave, whether it's your first time or you've been here before. I'm gonna keep it short and sweet today. I'm gonna to try to keep it under 15 minutes, so let's jump right into it. We're starting at the top of the mat in mountain, so that's standing nice and tall, palms face forward, roll the shoulders up into the ears and down the back, and I'll meet you when you're ready. All right, let's go ahead and get started. So again, at the top of your mat, feet flat, standing nice and tall, roll the shoulders up into the ears and then down the back. Palms face forward. Close the eyes if you feel comfortable. Maybe bring the chin down to the chest. And just start to breathe here. Start to arrive on the mat. Feel all 10 toes gripping the mat. Good, two more big breaths. Good, we'll open the practice with a big sigh out. So take a big breath in. And then exhale, let it go. Awesome, one more just like that, big breath in. Exhale, let it go. Awesome, go ahead and bring your head to a neutral space. Open the eyes if they were closed. We're gonna bring that right ear to the right shoulder. Good, maybe pull down with that left arm. Find some length in that left neck. Good, on the exhale, swing the head through the front, left ear, left shoulder. But really pull through that right hand as if you're trying to reach your foot. Good, inhale, bring the head to a neutral space. On the inhale, bring the arms up and over the head, interlace the fingers, flip the palms to the sky. Step that left foot behind the right, let it land on the pinky edge. Take a breath in, find length. On the exhale, bend over to the right side. Good, inhale, come through center, switch sides. Right foot comes behind the left. Inhale, first reach long. And then exhale, bend over to the left. Good, inhale, come through center. Uncross the fingers, keep the arms up. And then on your exhale, we're gonna slightly bend into the knees and just let everything fall forward. Good, and then on the inhale, lift the chest, arms come back over the head. Good, exhale, bend the knees, sit back into the hips, let it fall forward. Good, lift. Two more, just like that, shake it all out, whether you're starting your day or if you're in the middle of your day, just let it all go, let it all fall out. Good, this last one, stay hovered over. Maybe we straighten through the legs this time. Open the feet as wide as the mat. Grab opposite elbows, bend into the knees, Take a little sway here. Get all the crunchy out of the body. Just find some movement. Big deep breaths. Beautiful release. Bring the feet back into a comfortable distance. On the inhale, lift halfway. This time, bring the hands to the thighs. We're gonna do cat cow. So on the inhale, drop the belly, look forward, pull the shoulders back. Good, on the exhale, round the spine, tuck the tailbone, chin to the chest. Good, inhale. Exhale. Good, inhale, one more. Beautiful, exhale, round. Good, inhale, come to a neutral spine, and then straighten through the legs. On the inhale, arms reach all the way up. Good, on the exhale, forward fold. Fold back down, hands come down to the mat. Step the feet back to your down dog. Hips go up to the sky. And then maybe just start to find some movement that feels good in the body. Explore it here. Take these next two, two breaths to explore the body, explore the breath, what is present for you today. Be 
Beautiful, move towards stillness. Keep pushing the hips up to the sky. Hands are pushing into the mat. Heels are driving down into the mat. If they make it, great. If they don't, don't worry about it. Take a big breath in, breath out. Good, on the inhale, shift forward, you're in plank. Good, and then slowly lower all the way down to the mat. Fingertip the fingers on the outside of the mat, lift the chest up. Good, on the exhale, drop that right shoulder in. Good, inhale, lift. Exhale, left shoulder. Lift, beautiful exhale, lower the chest back down. Hands come underneath the shoulders, tuck the toes, send it back, down dog. Take a big breath in, breath out. Good, send the right leg up on the inhale. Bring the right knee to your nose. Good, and then lo slowly lower that right leg down to the floor so your right knee is on the floor. And then float that left leg. Send the right arm forward. Good, and then on the exhale, find the bind. If you don't make contact, don't worry. Just send the energy back. If we do connect, kick that foot into the hand, open the heart. Good, big breath in. Breath out. Good, release. Right hand comes back down to the floor. Tuck the left toes on the mat. Bring that right knee back into the chest again. And then we're gonna step it off to the left side of the mat. Drop that back heel, lift that left arm. You're in falling star, just for a breath. And then on the exhale, left hand comes down. Bring that right knee into the chest. Step it forward. Lift the chest on the inhale. You're in high lunge. Take a breath here. Take a breath out. Good. On the exhale, left heel drops. You're in warrior two. Reach to either side of the room. Good. Sink an inch deeper and then lift that right heel. It's a spicy. I know we said we're not gonna get sweaty, but it's only for a breath. Good, lower it. On the exhale, cartwheel the hands to the top of the mat. Frame that right foot. Option two, vinyasa, or send it right back to down dog. Your choice, your practice, your play. Whatever you choose, we'll meet back in down dog. And then take a big breath in. Breath out. Left leg goes up on the inhale. Bring that knee to the nose and then slowly lower it down to the mat. Good, hover that right leg off the floor and then left arm reaches forward, beautiful. And then on the exhale, reach back, can we find the bind? If we do, kick that foot into the hand, keep the hips square, sometimes we have a tendency to pull that foot over to the edge. Hold it. Good, release, left hand comes down. Right toes meet the floor. Bring that left knee into the chest again and then off to the right side of the mat. Lift the hips, right arm comes up, you're in falling star, shooting star. It's got a few names, whatever you call it. On the exhale, right hand comes down. Left knee comes into the chest, step it forward. On the inhale, lift, high lunge. Breath in, breath out. Slow it down. Take the ego out of your practice. Whatever it's telling you, you can or can't do, let it go, let the breath guide you. On the exhale, left heel, right heel drops, you're in warrior two. And then exhale, sink an inch deeper, lift that left heel. Add a little spice to the life, a little spice to the practice. Good, lower the heel. Cartwheel to the top of the mat on the exhale, step it back, vinyasa, or we meet back in down dog. Once you're in down dog, take a big breath in, breath out. Right leg goes up on the inhale. Step it towards the top of the mat. Your inhale lifts you, you're in high lunge. Good, let the arms come behind the back, let them interlace. Pull that heart open. Beautiful. Lean the chest forward. You're in a power lunge. Good. Hold it here. Big breath in. On the exhale, send it forward. You're in warrior three. 
One more breath. Root down through the all four corners of that right foot. Beautiful. Let that left foot plant one more time. Lean the chest back. Open the heart. Take a big breath here. Good. Exhale. Unwind the hands. Arms come up and over the head. Exhale. Frame that right foot. Step it back. Two down dog. Beautiful. Always an option to vinyasa. Left leg goes up on the inhale. Step it forward. High lunge. Lift the chest on the inhale. Good. Take a big breath in. Breath out. Good. Release. Let them interlace. Open the heart. Good. And then shift forward on the exhale. Power lunge. Good. Only for a breath. And then when you're ready, shift forward. Warrior three. Beautiful. And then step that right foot back. Keep leaning the chest back. Open up the heart. Take a breath here. Breath out. Good. Release. Send the arms up. Good. On the exhale, hands come down. Frame that left foot. Step it back to your down dog. Drop the knees. Keep the toes tucked. We're going to sit back onto the heels. Take that right arm underneath the left. Good. On the inhale, send the arms up. Arch the spine just like cat cow. Good. Exhale. Round. Bring that chin to the chest. Good. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Inhale. And exhale. Good. Bring it to a neutral space. Swing the feet around. Find your diamond shape. So that's the soles of the feet together. We're going to take our hands underneath our ankles and pull our head all the way down. I'm working with a little bit of a back injury, so I can't go all the way down, but ideally you would bring your forehead all the way down to your heels. Take a big breath in, breath out. Slow it down. Good, lift the chest, slide the legs out. Bend that left knee, left foot plants on the floor. Right arm comes up and over, hooking on that left knee. Left arm sits right behind the butt cheeks. And then on the inhale, turn the chest towards the left, opening up that heart. Keep pressing that right elbow into the left knee. Keep spinning. That right leg is nice and active, so keep it nice and tight. Good exhale, release, counter twist. So take your hands over to the right side. Just bow just a little bit. Beautiful release, switch sides. Right foot plants, right knee bends. Left arm comes up and then hook it over. Good, turn to the right, twist. Sitting up nice and tall. Sometimes in these twisting shapes, we tend to get all crunchy here. So if that's you, just throw like a towel underneath your butt to make some space in the body. Good, exhale, release. We'll close out the practice. Shavasana is always an option, but if we're short on time, I'll close it out with you. So sit up nice and tall, palms face up, close the eyes if you're comfortable, send the gaze down, chin to chest, and then just take a few more breaths, just settle the body and the mind. So whatever you're about to go back to, or whatever you're about to start today, you're going with a calm and centered mind, a calm and centered body. Remembering that your breath is your guide. So if at any point you feel restless, just breathe. Good. We'll close the practice out with a sigh out. So bring your hands to that third eye, that space in between your eyebrows. Take a big breath in. And then exhale, let it go. Awesome. Thank you for practicing with me. I hope you enjoyed today's practice. I'll see you again soon. Have a beautiful rest of your day. Bye.